another video at the Slime Lab. So today we're going to be doing the Slime vs. Slime game. I've only seen this once on Joseph Anthony's channel. I will link him down below so you can go check out his video. And so I'm going to be doing the same game. It's the Slime vs. Slime, Slime Smoothie of Death Challenge. I'm really excited to film this video and I really hope that you will enjoy this video. So don't forget to buy slime from my shop down below. I have slimes $1 per ounce, so I have 6 ounces and 8 ounce slimes in my shop right now, which are linked down below. Don't forget to subscribe, hit that notification bell to join the hashtag notification squad, and comment down below that you have joined that, and then you will get a shout out in next week's video. So the reason that I'm not showing my face is because just because I look terrible today, and but you need to have your like body for this video, so I just thought that I wouldn't show my face. So let's go on with this slime video. So I have this bag of eight different sized slimes, and they are random different slimes from different shops uh, that my brother put together for this video. So on just fans in these channels, this is how he described the game. So it's kind of like a game where you take two slimes and you can also play with it with squishies. Um, and you, you take two slimes, describe what you like and you don't like about um, the slime, and then whichever one you um, have that you don't like, that you like less, you put into a bucket that I have right here. And then at the end, all seven slimes that don't win, I will make into the slime smoothie of death. So I'm going to take two slimes. Okay, <laughs> so I picked out the bomb slime, which I reviewed on my channel before. This is Fruity Pebbles, which is going to be in my next restock. Okay, so we're starting with the bomb slime. I haven't touched this for a while. Oh, just so nice. I don't know. The clay has risen to the top since the last time I played with it. The bottom is really glossy. It has such an amazing, like, buttery texture. Like, I don't know how to say goodbye to this if I do. It's, the only thing I would say about it is it, it's supposed to be color changing. It's not color changing. That's okay. Okay, so this one is my Fruity Pebbles one. Oh, uh, the scent is so amazing. And I love the beads. It's just so glossy. It's so thick and clicky. And it self crunches. I don't know how to how to say goodbye to any of these slimes. It's so clicky, but the only thing that I would say that I don't like about this slime is that there aren't enough big foam beads. That's on me, but I love it so much. Okay, so out of these two. I just can't say goodbye to the bomb slime. I love it so, so much. So let's just put that over here. And pick it up. Slime Hive's like extra that they sent me, and this is Booberry from Scented Slime by Amy that I reviewed here on my channel. So yeah. So this is the Coal Cloud Slime. It. So I don't know about this slime. I really don't like it. Ugh. Sorry guys. It just I can't stand the smell. It smells terrible. Um. I don't know what it smells like. I think it's called Cold Cloud Slime. But it is such an amazing slime. I love the texture so much. It's such a drizzly cloud slime. But I don't know. The scent just makes me gag. So, yeah. So the next slime that I have is my scented slime by Emmy Booberry Slime. It's going to be so hard to say goodbye. Oh, it's such an amazing cloud slime. It's not as sizzly as the cold, as coal cloud slime. But it's just so amazing. It's super moldable. It's a lot more moldable than the cold cloud slime. Um, it drizzles a, li a little bit less. 
It's not as sizzly, but the scent is heavenly. It's so amazing. So I think I'm gonna pick. Mm, this is so hard, but I'm picking the scent of sun by Amy. my favorite slimes ever um but this is sparkling citrus from the sign by amy and it this is cotton candy slushy from tibble slime i'm going to start off with the tibble slimes cotton candy slushy i filmed the review for this um i don't know when i'm going to put it out probably soon but it's a super super crunchy like Clear glue slushy slime um, with the inst like the not instant snow but the artificial winter snow. Um, it's just one of my favorite scents ever. It's scented like cotton candy. It has a really stretchy uh, texture. It has a really like amazing texture. It feels really good on your hands. It's like a massage on your hands. It's really moldable. So it's a really awesome slime. So let's go on to the next one. So this is Sparkling Citrus. Oh, it's such a nice, like, it's like a Laffy Taffy slime feel. Uh, it has like a little diamond in it. Just fell on the floor, but. It smells a lot like grapefruit. It's a really like pink slime. It kind of looks like the slime Atelier's bubble gum. Um, it has a really stretchy texture, really glossy. Um, it's very clicky, very pokeable. So overall, this slime is just so amazing. So I don't know how I'll say goodbye. Okay, so out of the two, I don't know. Um, I think I'm going to have to throw Amy's slime. So I'm going to pick my next one. Snowman kit and the slime atelier's uh, midnight horror slime. So I don't know how I'm gonna be able to say goodbye to any of these, but yeah. So the first slime I'm gonna show this is a, this is a safe bounce, but it does sell in clear. Yeah, I know self included in clear slime. What? Um, but it is. So the pro is it's I don't even know how she does it, but it's so 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 cool. It's like blue clear. And it's like a jelly. So I don't even know how I'm going to part with this. But So I don't even know how to describe it. It doesn't have a scent, which is a downside of the slime. But it's just so nice. And when it has bubbles in it, it looks like it's pigmented. But it is not that stretchy. So this next one is the Build Your Own Snowman Kit. I got this on Black Friday. It has such a nice French vanilla scent. Uh, it smells so good. It's super, super stretchy. I don't think there's anything that I have to say badly about this. There's nothing that I have to say. Although it is a little pricey. It was $22, which is a little bit much for an 8-ounce slime. But I just really love it. It's a cloud slime, sort of. Cloud cream, more. But it's really elastic, and I really like that about slime. Um, it has the most amazing scent. I don't even know how to say goodbye to this. So after a long decision, because I love both of the slimes so much, I'm going to throw the Slime Atelier, just because it's not as stretchy, and I don't like the scent because it's unscented. So I have Tibble Slime's Cotton Candy Slushy. Uh, slime Hives Coal Cloud, Parakeet Slimes Build Your Own Snowman Kit, and the Bomb Slime Creamsicle. So let's put them back in the bag. Mix it up. So 
have Cotton Candy Slushy and Coal Cloud. So, I'm gonna do table ones. I totally, like, I don't even know if I'm gonna take a bite of this. It's just so crunchy and so moldable and it's very holdable. I love that when signs are holdable. I don't know if I could ever say goodbye to this. So I have cold cloud now. I can't say goodbye to any of these. So hard. Um, the scent is just terrible. I, I know I've said that. I just really do not like the scent. But it's so sizzly and so, so dri the drizzles are goals. I don't even know. It's just like so amazing. I don't want to say goodbye to either of these, so I'm just going to. And then. Oh no, I have to say goodbye to Cold Cloud. So, bye Cold Cloud. Okay, so. I have Paracoot Slimes, Boudron Snowman Kit, and the Bomb Slime Cream Sicome, the two last slimes other than the Cotton Candy Slushy. So, let's start with the Bomb Slime. I love this slime so much, I could never say goodbye to this. This is such an amazing butter slime. It's like really just, I have no idea what to say. It has a really amazing French vanilla scent, like parakeet slimes. Um, it's not as holdable as a cloud slime, which is a downside, but it's not a cloud slime. But, so, it is a little bit runny, um, but I have never felt this texture before. It's just, I don't know how to even describe it. So this one is the parakeet slimes, Bold Your Snowman Kit. Um, this is the hardest decision of the whole, whole one. It's a really amazing, holdable, moldable, spreadable cloud cream slime. It's not a cloud slime. I wouldn't call it a cloud slime, Marissa, but it's more of a cloud cream, but call it whatever you want. It comes with these little charms. I... If you're watching this, I probably think that you watched my first video. Um, but ha again, super amazing French vanilla scent, and I don't know how to say goodbye to any of these slimes. So I can't say goodbye to either of these, so I'm just going to put it back in the bag. No! So I have to say goodbye to the bomb slime. though. Bye. So this is the final two slimes. I never thought that these would make it to the final two. But I couldn't say goodbye to either parakeet slimes or the cold, or the bomb slime. I bet I would have picked the bomb slime if it really was my choice, but I want to be fair. I love the slime. It's such an amazing slushy slime. I love the scent, but this was a bit of a price. It was $10 for a 4 ounce, which is a little bit of a price, um, but that's okay. Um, I saw my 4 ounces for $4. So then I have Carrot Slimes Build Your Own Snowman Kit. Oh, this is so hard. I don't even know I'm going to say goodbye. But this is just one of my all time favorite slimes ever. Very mad at my brother for putting this in in my box in my bag, but it has to be done. So out of the two, I don't even know. It's just so hard, but <laughs> I have to say goodbye to Tibble Slimes. So the overall winning slime was Parakeet Slimes um, Build Your Own Snowman Kit. I am just shocked. But I had to keep it. It's just my favorite slime ever. So if you guys are watching this, go comment on Marissa's newest restock and say that 
the slime mob did a video of the slime her slime video and tell her that her slime won. So let's get on to the slime smoothie. How many more color do you think that the slime smoothie is gonna turn into um, before I finish mixing? So this is the finished product. I did not expect this to be like that. Um, if you guys want me to sell this in my shop this week, then just comment down below if you want me to do that. So also, don't forget to subscribe and turn on the post notifications to become a member of the Sliminator Squad. And comment down below, Sliminator Squad, if you want to have a chance to get a shout out in my next video. Don't forget to buy from my shop and bye guys.